Ignition, engine full power, and liftoff of Crew-9, go SpaceX, go Falcon, go NASA. Blasting off Launch Pad 40 atop a Falcon 9 rocket, SpaceX Crew-9 headed for the International Space Station for a crew rotation that's become anything but normal. The vehicle is supersonic. On board, veteran astronaut Commander Nick Haig and Russian astronaut Alexander Gorbanov. Staying behind, original crew members Zena Cardman and Stephanie Wilson. Their empty seats will be taken by Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams on the return flight in February. One, ignition. Wilmore and Williams have been on the space station since June, unable to return home due to problems with their Boeing Starliner spaceship, which returned home without them. Now, Williams has been named space station commander. This is my happy place. I love being up here in space. It's just fun. Williams and Wilmore are getting new space suits since their Boeing suits can't be used in a SpaceX ship on return. And since they trained in Boeing Starliner, they now have to learn the SpaceX systems while already in orbit. Crew 9 docks with the space station at 5.30 p.m. Eastern time, not returning home until next February, by which time Wilmore and Williams' 10-day mission will have lasted eight months. For today, Tom Costello, NBC News, Washington. Tom, thank you very much. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or Click the link right here.